things. The way the human body, soul, and mind all work together is that if you can get someone to do something every single day, it gets ingrained into our memories, our subconscious. There's 40,000 of the same thoughts that are harnessing and regenerating to create neural map pathways in our brain which signal our own characteristics, personality, obsessions, and addictions. They signal what I call a quantum memory. They signal your DNA. They can chain, change that chain of someone who's born into negativity, born into poverty, born into alcoholism, born into disease, you actually can effectuate change. So knowing how the conscious, subconscious, and unconscious continuum work, lowering the bar and asking someone for two minutes, and then giving them simple things like, all I want you to do is to say thank you before you go to bed and when you wake up. And if you can do that for 30 straight days, I will guarantee them that their life will change. If you can say or think thank you before you go to bed, and say it and think it when you wake up, for 30 straight days, I guarantee you, it'll change your life. Now, how many here think you can do that for 30 straight days? Invariably, everybody raises their hand. <laughs> now, I'll also warn them that 99% of the people that I give this challenge to can't do it. The saddest part is by tonight, half of you will not say or think thank you. By the morning, another half of you will not say or think thank you. And unfortunately, in three days, almost all of us will forget to say thank you. I've given you the easiest way, gratitude, to change your life. And yet we're so far in our own way, we can't even say thank you for 30 straight days. I actually would challenge all the speeches. I traveled 200 days a year, spoke on stages all around the world. And I felt like such a hypocrite because I challenged people saying, look, you want to change your life? Give me 0.1 seconds. Say thank you before you go to bed and when you wake up 30 straight days. It took me nine months. Me, who was born into this stuff, right. took me nine months to get out of my own way and not forget one day. I always would forget a night or a morning. It's so difficult for the human mind, body, and soul to do something consistently. If you're going to take a lesson into life, lower the bar so you can do it every day. And when you feel I can't do it, just lower the bar as low as it can get. You get the benefit of exponential growth and acceleration if you can have someone harness that power of consistency, which leads to persistency, which is not quitting, which is the number one thing that stops us as we quit and getting in our own way, and then allow them to pursue their own potential. We develop that side of it to vote for what they want.